Hey everybody, welcome to Comics with Bueller. As always, I'm Bueller. Today's my top 10 picks for new comics coming out March 18th, 2020. This way shows you some great covers, some great stories, and some spec books you might want to be on the lookout for. If you're new to our channel, do me a favor, subscribe right now. It does help us out a lot. And also turn on that notification button because you don't want to miss our next video. Don't forget to go to Max Pro Supplies for all your comic book supply needs. Enter the code Bueller at checkout and you save 10%. I want to remind everyone that we do show all the trade paperbacks that are coming out this week at the end of the video, so stick around for that. Let me know what you like. Okay, everyone, I'm all jacked up on coffee yet again, so let's not waste any more time. Let's take a look at my top 10 picks for new comics coming out March 18th, 2020. First up, we have Captain Marvel, number 16, Legacy number 150, brought to you by Kelly Thompson. This is the last Avenger conclusion, the storyline. We have Captain Marvel against Vox Supreme. Who do you think is going to win? They've already planned issue 17, so I'm pretty sure I know who it's going to be. We got a couple different covers. We got the regular cover, which is great. And then we have the Boss Logic variant. This one looks awesome. I'm definitely going to try to pick this one up. This one has a regular cover price of $3.99. Next book up is Spider-Woman number one, brought to you by Carla Pacheco. I actually had a chance to read this book already. Thank you very much, Marvel. I enjoyed the book. It starts out with Spider-Woman on this boat. She's like private security for this group. And of course, the bad guys show up and she has to defeat the bad guys. And that's kind of what she does. But it's on like this ship out in the middle of the ocean. So it's a little weird. And then it jumps back in time for a couple weeks. And it kind of shows you how she got there. Beginning of the storyline. I really enjoyed it. Looking forward to issue number two. But this issue has a few different covers that I like. The regular cover, which actually is one of my favorites. And then we have the art germ variant. I like that one a lot. But I want to be honest, her boobs look a little weird. I don't know. And then the next one is the Dare Chu variant. This one looks pretty good as well. I'm definitely going to try to pick one of these up. This one has a regular cover price of $4.99. Only two Marvel books on the list this week, but we do have some DC stuff. We have Batman number 91, brought to you by James Tinney in the fourth. This one apparently, Batman and Harley Quinn, she's his new sidekick. They're supposed to go out there and prevent Catwoman from stealing some stuff. Interesting. I thought they had a thing together. Who knows? He's been killing it on this title, James Tinian. There's no reason why this book shouldn't be as good as the last one's. We have a few different covers. We have the regular cover, and then we have the Funky Cole Matina cover. You might want to pick up that one. It's got Penguin on the front. Looks kind of cool. But this one has a regular cover price of $3.99. Moving on, we have Deceased Unkillables number two. I believe this is a three-part series. This is brought to you by Tom Taylor. I've always enjoyed the Deceased storyline from the regular ones last year, and now this one. We got all the villains kind of coming together, and this one we have like Batwoman and another character I can't remember, but they're trying to defeat all the undead people from invading the school filled with children, and that sounds interesting, kind of gross and disgusting, and we'll see what happens, but we kind of already know what happened, so... It's a good story. Check it out. We got a couple of different covers I like. We got the regular cover. And then we have the horror movie homage cover. I like that one as well. I believe that is a cardstock, so it might be a dollar more. I could be wrong. But this has a regular cover price of $4.99. Next up is Nightwing number 70. This is the start to the journey of the Joker Wars. It starts in this book, and the cover on this one looks pretty good. I've never bought a Nightwing comic, but you know what? I'm probably going to get this one. This one is going to sell out fast. I think it's already going for twice cover price. But just so you guys know, there is a second printing already in the works. So if you miss out on this one, pick up the second printing. The regular cover is the one I like, and this one has a cover price of $3.99. Moving on the image, we have Spawn number 306 brought to you by Todd McFarlane. This is the Prophecy of Death storyline part one. We have some ninja spawn action. That's kind of interesting. I'm looking forward to checking this out. And we got a few really good looking covers as well. We have the regular cover and then we have the D cover that's by McFarlane himself. I like that one a lot. That's probably the one I'm going to pick up. The best thing about this book is it has a regular cover price of $2.00 and 99 cents thank you yet again todd mcfarlane next up is alienated number two brought to you by simon spurrier this is boom studios 
This has been a really fun series. The first one came out a few weeks ago. I like that. It's about this group of kids that run into some kind of creature or alien in the woods. And this creature gives them powers to read each other's thoughts. They can actually communicate with each other from across long distances just with their brains. And it's kind of interesting. In the first issue, this alien thing ate this kid. And now we're going to find out what happened. If he eats some more kids, we'll find out. But anyway, there's a couple different covers. We got the regular cover, which is pretty cool. And then we have the FOC variant. I like that one as well. That's Final Order Cutoff. If people are asking about that, that's what that means. Anyways, this has a regular cover price of $3.99. But we're not done with Boom yet because something is killing the children. Number six, brought to you by, yet again, James Tiny in the fourth. And the person who's killing the children isn't the creature from Alienated. That's a whole different one that killed that little kid. There's other creatures that apparently adults can't see, but the kids can. And then the creature eats the kids. And now that's what this book is about. In this one, they're wrapping up the original story arc. And now they're starting a new one. I've already read it. I liked it. It introduces some new characters. A little bit of backstory about the main character. So you'll get to find out a lot about that in this one. We got a few different covers. We got the regular cover. And then we have the FOC variant. And then we have the 1 in 25 variant. Three covers to choose from. Pick them all up if you can. If not, no big deal. This one has a regular cover price of $3.99. And I also want to tell you, Boom Studios has Red Mother number 4 coming out this week. Another one of my favorite titles. So if you get a chance, check that one out as well. Next one up is The Resistance number 1 by J. Michael Stasinski. I think I got that right. This is by AWA. That's the publisher. I think they're new. I'm not sure. I'm not tremendously familiar. But actually, they have a bunch of titles coming out this week. A bunch of number ones. This is the one that interests me the most. This, this one's about a global disaster that killed hundreds of millions of people. And shortly after, thousands of people arise. And they have superpowers. And apparently, all hell breaks loose. Because hundreds of millions of people wasn't enough. And they have to have this piled onto it. So it sounds like an interesting concept. I'm definitely going to check it out. We got a couple different covers. We got the regular cover and then we have the cover B by Day Dotto Jr. This one looks pretty good. This one has a regular cover price of $3.99. Next one up is Artemis and the Assassin number one brought to you by Stephanie Phillips. This is an Aftershock comic. This one is about time traveling assassins for hire. If you pay enough money, they'll go kill people for you and change history or the past and the future and all that stuff. We all know what happens. We all watch Back to the Future. That's what we're going to get in this one. Anyway, like I said, Artemis and the Assassin number one. Time traveling assassins. What's better than that? We got a couple different covers. We got the regular cover, and then we have the one in 15 incentive cover. I forgot to tell you, but this does have a cover price of $4.99. Now you're sitting there and thinking, wait a minute, that was 10 titles. It sounds like he's not done. We are not done because we are going full spinal tap on this one all the way up to 11. If you know what I'm talking about, there you go. The next one on our list is Dragon Whisper number one, brought to you by Alex DeLuca. This one is brought to you by Red 5 Comics. This one is kind of a steampunk airship type thing. There's an airship captain. His one goal in life is to kind of hunt down this dragon. Apparently, he's causing a lot of problems. And then he runs into this girl who is a dragon whisperer. Apparently, she talks to dragons. And maybe his opinions change. We got just one cover, and it looks pretty good. And this one has a regular cover price of $3.99. All right, guys. So that's my top 10 picks for new comics coming out March 18th, 2020. Let me know what you thought. Let me know what you bought. Let me know what I forgot, because I want to know. Let's go ahead and take a few minutes to check out all those trades coming out this week. So I'll see you in a few. First up was Black Panther and the Agents of Wakanda, Volume 1. Captain America, Epic Collection, Blood and Glory. Captain America, Winter Soldier, Marvel, Select Edition, Hardcover. Conan the Barbarian, Volume 2. Immortal Hulk, Volume 6, Trade Paperback. King Thor, Trade Paperback. Marvel Masterworks Dazzler Volume 1, the hardcover. Marvel's 25th Anniversary hardcover. New Mutants Epic Collection. 
Star Wars Volume 13, Taskmaster Right Placed Trade Paperback, X-Men Milestones Messiah Complex, X-Men Avengers Onslaught Volume 1 on the DC, Batman Alfred Pennyworth Trade Paperback, Batman Universe Hardcover, Superman Volume 2, and Wonder Woman The Golden Age Omnibus Volume 4. Chrononauts Volume 2, this is Image. Nomen Omen Volume 1. Oblivion Song Volume 4. Pretty Deadly Volume 3. Trees Volume 3. On the Boom Studios Lumberjanes Volume 6 Hardcover. Bloodshot Volume 2. Money Shot Trade Paperback. Hey guys, welcome back. Hope you saw a bunch of those trades that you like. If you're buying any of those, please let me know. I might actually pick one up, but like last week and I didn't, this week will probably be the same. All right, guys, that's all I got for you. Don't forget to like and subscribe. You know what to do. I'll see you next time. Be safe, everybody. Bye.